Hey guys, welcome to Two Dimension Comics Podcast. Um, I'm your host, Dallas Busha. We're trying something a little new this episode, so bear with us. Um, what I'm doing, I'm going to be broadcasting this simultaneously. This will be on our most recent episode of the podcast, and it'll also be a short video on our YouTube page. You can find our podcast pretty much anywhere that you can find podcasts in general. Um, I mean, you can find us on iTunes. We also have a website, bunchofdorks.com. Go on that site, you click on the Cyclops, takes you to an entire list of all our shows. Um, you can find us on YouTube now. It's pretty new. We have a couple videos up. There's another video on the YouTube page that has the whole gang together uh, hanging out for free comic book day. Some really good video of just everybody just kind of chilling, hanging out. Um, we're at Yancey Street Comics, so you get some some video of that and a little bit of the costume contest too. So it's pretty cool. So check that out. Just go on YouTube, just, um, just keyword Two Dimension Comics, you'll be able to find us. Thanks a lot. Um, so, real quick, um, I picked up some new books. I started picking up a new monthly, and it's called Injection by Warren Ellis, drawn by Declan Shalvey, and the colors are by Jordi Belair. Got the first five issues so far. Number one. Number two. Number three, which I absolutely love this cover. Fantastic. Uh, number four. And number five. Now, there are multiple covers for each of the issues. Uh, these are just happened to be the ones that were at Yancey on the uh, on the spinner rack when I when I picked them up. So, real quick, I just want to talk about it a little bit. The writing, uh, you know, as expected, is very Warren Ellis. It's, it's methodical. It's slow. There's huge payoff if you stick with the story. If you pay attention, you follow it. Um, the art's pretty stylistic. It fits the theme well enough. There's uh, a lot of fantastic flashbacks, and the art, the background art, was very well executed there. I really like it. Um, just a couple little... Sorry, everybody on the podcast. Good stuff, though. All right. Um, so, of course, we have Jordi Belair. She does the colors now. As usual, she's awesome. She's everywhere in the medium right now. And um, for this particular book, the colors are what really pull you in, even more so than the art for me. It's, it's an obvious combination, but the colors create such a, an amazing mood. Um, you just feel like you're being rained on during an overcast day in England. It's got that kind of downtrodden feeling to it, which uh, is exactly what Alice is going for, I believe. So, kind of, here, here's an overview, a quick overview of the book. And minor spoilers in here, but I'm going to keep this as vague as possible. Basically, the story centers around a group of five exceedingly intelligent individuals. Um, they've inadvertently created a program that's out of their hands, and it's menacing the world as we know it. So they're kind of going about trying to, to fix this, to, you know, to fix the, the problem that they created. Um, the, the story itself unfolds very slowly. Um, the scenes kind of spin around. They go from uh, different places in the world, and they focus on the different members of the group who are not all together at the same time, at least not at the start of the book. Um, if you're ready for a bit of a mind-bender like this, I mean, if it sounds like something up your alley if you like Warren Ellis, it's got surreal visuals, it's got his uh, trademark in-your-face dialogue and themes. It's absolutely fantastic. I really do like it. Um, I recommend it for you guys. All right, thank you so much. Um, there should be a lot more videos up on YouTube soon, and the new episode of the podcast should be coming out in about a week. So thanks a lot, guys. Enjoy yourselves.